Canada and based in New York. The bespectated 20-year-old Filipino transformed from a YouTube sensation into an intricate, infectious, and irresistible rap presence right in front of an audience of millions. To be exact, he has 309,000 subscribers and 70 million plus cumulative views. MTV dubbed him an artist to watch, while XXL nominated him as its esteemed 2013 freshman class list. Now he's ready for the next chapter with his 2013 debut six-track EP, Canal and Rich Bill. Please welcome D. Prime. Amazing. This is amazing. May I get a bottle of water? Do I have my bottle of water here? Hold on, I need to do a hype check. Left side, can y'all make some noise? I'm gonna let you guys know this left side had their hands up. So we're gonna make like a little competition. They had their hands up the whole time. What about my right side? How y'all doing? This is great. What about the middle? All right, all right. So I do this every show I do. I usually get third 
with me, so I bring my water. Until I'm done sipping this water, I want you to scream until I put the bottle down. Is that cool? Three, two, one. All right, great job, great job. So, I would just like to say being Filipino is awesome because we have, we have a lot of rising stars and we're, we're like a cult culture, like we follow everybody who is doing something great for our community. There's Manny Pacquiao, people like Jessica Sanchez out here trying to make a difference for us and we're great people. We're into the art, we're super passionate about each other, we're super patriotic and um, <laughs> I'm super, I'm super proud of one thing, right? And, and besides being who I am, I'm super proud of like the women that we have, the Filipino women. If you are a girl in the audience, please make some noise. <laughs> now, I know there's way more girls than that. Women scream! <laughs> this is great, this is great. So ladies, can I sing for you guys just a bit? I, I forgot to tell you that I sing too, other than rap. Can I do that for you guys? All right, let's go. This is for all my Filipino women in the audience. I love you all. Make some noise. Make some noise. this one to the left side. Every lady on the left side. You are amazing. They have these little, uh, they, ha they have these yellow things. It's just like killing it. I need all of you guys to have that same energy. Um, I like to dedicate this one to uh, the lady I met that sold me a brownie. Her name's Marina. She's, she's pretty cute. Um, but anyway, we're in here tonight. Everybody make some noise. All right, ladies, I got another one for you. Let's go. Yes. Well, hello and hi there. I never knew you were weird like me. Thought I was the only one. And now it seems like I'm not that lonely. Can't believe it, boy, don't understand you. And it seems like you don't love it. And I think we have more in common, so think twice. Hands up! Now we can be like Cosmo and Wanda. Music and lyrics. And it covers We can be like waffles and syrup So take my hand today And we can turn now into last week And turn you and him to you and me Everybody go! Take you to a place where You don't have to think of it And we can go wherever you want Oh, if you 
I'm so sorry guys, they won that one. So let me tell you guys a brief story about myself. I'm 20 years old, I'm from Brampton, Ontario. Um, I'm a proud Filipino. I, I, I love being who I am. Salam abo to everybody in the audience. Um, everybody, get, give yourselves a round of applause. I'm hearing claps, give yourselves a round of applause. I just wanna say, I'm completely and utterly proud of who I am. Um, I, I come from an industry, a predominantly black industry, and being in this music industry, everybody puts you down. Everybody says, you're Filipino, you can't sell this many records. You're Filipino, you can't get this many views on a video. Well, guess what, I proved them wrong. I, I went to a radio station, they told me that I didn't make the cut of a look of a rapper. They didn't want to play my song. Three years later, I worked to that goal. I got on the radio with this song, it took over, it was a top 40 single, and I proved to them that a Filipino artist can actually break into the mainstream, into this thing. And I did it. I did it for not only me, but I did it for us. So everybody, make some noise for yourselves! With that being said, with that being said, I am so proud of who I am. So please, with pride in yourselves, put your hands up for this next song. It's my first radio single called Lifted. Let's go. Yeah. 
Young college girl, what's your life like? All eyes on you like it's fight night. And you ain't even looking for the right type. And if the mother girls hate me, tell them bye bye. <laughs> I'm riding high, looking slow. Rapping from my city like I'm 50 on that Brooklyn float. And I'm like, hey, no, what you looking for? They tell me that I changed. My cockiness is overdose. Now when that beat switch up, I feel just like a million dollar girls. Dollar plus my click, we keep it trillin'. If they do it like us, know that we can do it better. I know the party started when I enter. You can tell them I can turn them know about the news that happened back home it's really tragic to talk about um, I know we have a number of people who've been affected by it or their families have so please if you could a prayer would be nice on the way out a prayer would be nice before bedtime I made this song for all the world's struggles everything going on we have to be thankful for what we have and we definitely have to be mindful of everything going on in the world I want you all to know that we're all one we're all united as one I'm proud to be a Filipino, and I'll support them till the death of me. So please, everybody, make some noise for the strong people out there who are still living, who are still trying their best to live within means of this disaster, everybody. So for that, I'd like to dedicate this next song. This next song is my last song. This one's called Start Again. Let's go. And if you could, your phone in the air with your light out, a lighter in the air. Let's do this. Yeah. Another, Another chapter passes by in the novel of my legacy. Waking, waking up, up the sunshine, my mama flipping eggs for me. Dad's out of work, little sisters in elementary. Older brothers sleeping in, I'm changing the perspective to a kid out up in Africa who never has a bite to eat. Struggling with no water, with his tummy rolling silently. Ask yourself, are you having the worst day of your life? Cause there's people in the world just being hurt all day and night. And of course we have our struggles in our day, it's always messed up. But worse things can happen, you just gotta keep your head up. To everybody out there having sorrow at a measure. Just know today's a blessing, tomorrow will be better, let's go. comes in, I keep going. The problems at night, I start over in the morning. When people put me down all night, just have enough. Touch myself and then I get back up. And I just wanna fly. 